Hello and welcome to the May edition of the Rutherford Report. Coming up on today's edition... We report back from the recent BBC School Report on Newsday. A glimpse at the new student short film, Snare. And an update on the Year 9 STEM Day. Welcome to the May edition of the Rutherford Report. We are here to give you a roundup of recent events and news at Mark Rutherford School. First up this month, the staff and students have been promoting Autism Awareness Week with numerous activities. Cake sales and raffles have been raising money for Autism Bedfordshire and beds opportunities for learning disabilities who continue to provide valuable services to our past and present students. Great work guys! Let's have a look at what happens on this year's BBC School Report. On the 15th of March, 26 students took part in the National News Day with BBC School Report. We were able to develop their skills in researching, writing, presenting and filming a news bulletin. In March, the PE department supported sport relief through quizzes, a badminton tournament, the sport relief mile and Mufti. Students and staff managed to raise £416.28 in total. Thank you to everyone who supported sport relief throughout the week. Let's join Ethan who's going to take us through some of the most recent STEAM activities. Thanks guys. Here are some of the most recent STEAM news. On 27th of March, the Smartest Club Evening took place, where club leaders Amy, Holly, Freya and Sarita planned and presented an evening of fun activities for the parents and the children involved in our Tuesday Night Club. Great work, guys. Also, Year 9s took part in a STEAM day where a number of engineers and scientific activities took place. The students thoroughly enjoyed the day and were well engaged with the tasks. Here are some of the recent drawings of the week. This drawing by Shannon in Year 11, this illustration by Caitlin in Year 11, and this interesting portrait by Olivia in Year 8. I'll be back next month with more STEAM news. Back to you guys in the studio. All is gearing up for the Cambodia trip taking place in July. The team recently held another quiz night. During the evening raised just over £800. They would like to thank everybody who came along and supported them. Let's have an exclusive look at the new Mark Rutherford short film, Snare. Hi, I'm Daniel. I'm Chloe. And I'm Jade. And we are a few of the directors of the short film Snare. We've been working on this short film since January of this year and it's about two teenagers who fall in love but things get very dark. Hello, I'm Annie and I play Hallie Callender in Snare. Oh, you are joking! I've got to go! He's going to oh, kill look, me! Look, I'm sorry. Hi, my name's Ben. George is your stereotypical teenage boy who plays all the sports and has all the friends. You! Of course it's you. Hi, my name's Elise. I play Lauren in Snare. Did you actually think he really liked you? Honestly, you can have him. Snare is about two students in love, but they're taunted by the ex-girlfriend. We've been filming since January and there's a whole team of directors that have been working together. Planning it, editing the scripts, figuring out what was going to be where and how that would plan out. Come watch Snare, the premiere. Tickets! We'll be on sale at the school shop soon. I just want it to stop! Look, let me talk to her, okay? God, I'll tell her! Just don't write it all off now, please. I can't speak to you right now. Hallie, please! Just leave me alone! Hallie! Hallie, please! I know what you're thinking. We broke up. But what you don't realise is, it never really got started. George, how'd you like to go out for dinner sometime? Tuesday? And that's where it went wrong. Threats, warnings, it was swallowing me up day by day. Me? 
or her. In March, another successful breakfast meeting was held on the theme of careers in the cultural arts sector. Students from dance, drama, music and art met with a range of professionals and heard their personal success stories. Professions represented this morning included actors, architects, editors, theatre production managers and museum managers. Thank you to everyone who supported the event. Let's catch up with Ashley for Sports News. Hi, I'm Ashley and here's this month's sports news. Our Year 8 football team were awarded district champions after a 5-4 win against Lincroft on the 26th of April. Well done guys. Our Year 10 football team secured a 5-0 win against St Thomas More on the 19th of April. They are expected to go through to the semi-finals. Good luck guys. On 22nd of March, our students went to Auburn Academy, Toronto Year 5 and 6 Tag Rugby Tournament. Our students ran the whole competition themselves. Teams came from Auburn, Reynold and Ravenson. Thank you to Lauren, Samir and Luke for running the event. I'll be back next month for more sports news. Back to the studio. That concludes the May edition of the Rutherford Report. On behalf of our team, we wish you the best of luck if you are taking exams this month. We'll be back next month. Bye. Goodbye.